it's definitely a niche. But we're making mud guards for people who don't want mud guards. With the new wind wing, we wanted to offer more. More protection for more bikes while keeping it beautiful and super simple. We make a lot of prototypes. Yeah. On our way to work or on our vacations, there is always some kind of work in progress attached to our bikes. We found out that it's only the rear half of a straight fender that actually protects you. This is because water and dirt doesn't leave the wheel in a radial direction, but rather at the tangent. In order for the tangential coverage to work properly, the mudguard needs to be installed very close to the wheel. With the bracket so close, it's important that it doesn't jam. The big challenge was to keep the product dead simple. Not only to make it ultra light, but complexity always means trouble. And keeping it simple is also key for how we can produce in Sweden. We've spent a lot of time trying to reduce the number of components. Other fenders may consist of up to 40 components. The wind wing only has four. Should we do a break? Yeah. Woo! I like that we're a small company where everyone is more or less involved with everything. So when we develop something new, we naturally consider things like assembly and packaging right from the start. We work with local suppliers for the manufacturing, so we're keeping things really close. You can even ride your bike there. It's so natural. To be able to produce a fairly simple product in Sweden and exporting it to the whole world, sometimes even to China, is a bit upside down, but somehow also very satisfying. <laughs> For me, the best quality of the wind wing is the balance between function, simplicity and aesthetics. We really pushed ourselves and I think it paid off. I truly think it's the best product we've ever made. I do. I mean, that's the truth. Det är en sexen. Han flyttar ut till...